Hey there, beautiful one. How are you? Welcome. Welcome to Reese Reading Journey. I am Chief Empress Healing Flower, aka Journey. And I am doing a reading, darling, for you. For you, sweetheart. If you're new, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. So glad to have you. Not going to really do too much of a meditation, but I am going to do a little bit of well, you know what? Yes, if you want a four, go ahead. But I want to do just a little bit of a meditation. For those of you who may have just wake, woken up, or if you just um, uh, just had a rough day, whatever, right? But if you don't need it, that's perfectly fine. We're just going to use a very short one, three deep breaths in and out. We're just going to shut our eyes and that's it, all right? So I'm going to have you relax for me, you know, work that neck around. And I'm going to go ahead and hit this bowl for you, okay? Close your eyes, drop your shoulders, let's go. Breathe in. And out. Let's do it again, you're doing amazing. Breathe in. Feel yourself connecting with the universe, connecting with the all that is, getting all the answers that you need. Again, let's go. In and out. Just sit with it for a second. Roll your head if you need to. Just wind it around a little bit. Just rotating it. Feel that connection, feel yourself being supported, feel yourself knowing that no weapon formed against you shall ever prosper. All right, thank you so much, I appreciate you, appreciate you. All right, darling, let's see what's going on. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What's going on, sweet spirit? I must acknowledge my mama, my papa, my spiritual parents who helped me every step of the way, my ancestors and guides. By myself, I'm a powerhouse, but with them, watch out. Okay. All right, let's get into it, sweet spirit. I want to come out but... mm -hmm. five of swords okay defeat mm. yeah and you know what I picked that up with my shuffling this is the second time I'm really noticing that um you could have de defeated a soulmate okay soulmate can be family can be your mama can be your papa be your sister, brother, cousin, could be your teacher, your third grade teacher, could be your, uh, you know, any teacher, people you grew up with, people who sh helped shape and mold you. Um, I feel like you defeated a soulmate here. I also feel, because I did see that card earlier, I feel like they're worried about you being happy. Somebody's a little discouraged because you're happy. Or you're going on a happiness. Tell me more. What's going on? What's this person upset? What's this person thinking? Yeah, you left them, I heard. You left them. This person is like, they are angry with you. They are fighting with you, even though you're not fighting. I know, I, I, I don't know, sweetheart. They are fighting with you and you aren't fighting. They're fighting with you because of something abundant. You're about to have an abundant life. You're, be, you're abundant. You're having a happy life. You're not fighting with them. That's the thing. I don't feel like you give two poobly doos. But this person is angry. 
and they feel like they're in, they feel like they're, oh, ooh, I heard a war with you. They feel like they're in a war with you. Because there's something about you being abundant, happy. This could mean abundance can mean many things. Um, in this particular case, you're about to be abundant, successful, happy. You are abundant already. Someone sees you that way. It's abundant, successful, happy. I feel like this person, though, they, they stabbed you in the back here. They stabbed you in the back. And I feel like... Yeah, somebody, you could have children with this person. Others of you, again, this could be a family member. This could be even a co-worker that you worked with for years. Yeah, they feel like they failed as a friend. I'm hearing that song. It's a... Ooh, my sister Sledge. What the heck? That's so old. You're a friend to me. You're a friend to me. Wanna hold you in my arms. Okay. So somebody definitely wants you to be in their life again, whether it's family, lover, whatever it is. But they definitely feel like they failed you in some type of way. Especially if they were um, supposed to be supportive to you in some type of way, whether this was a parent and they weren't the parent that they needed to be, husband or wife that they needed to be, supporter, had your back. Somebody had a business with a relative, I'm picking that up as well, and the business slipped or they did something shisty with the business or it did something to sabotage you in some type of way because they were jealous. Man, oh man, 707 on the clock. Sometimes I just don't understand, folks. I don't. Sierra, I don't get it. For those of you new, I call my folks here because we see stuff. You know what I'm saying? And it's just, it just floors me at how I just don't understand this type of behavior. I just don't get it. Did I just put my cards upside down? I sure did. Wait, did I? I don't know. I can't tell. But anyway, they feel like they failed you. But you defeated somebody. And that defeat is by you. I feel like the energy I'm getting is you chose your own path. You said no more. I'm like, bump this. I ain't doing this no more with you. I ain't doing this no more with y'all. Heck no. Enough is enough. Yeah, I'm getting it clearly. Enough is enough. Somebody just was like, I can't do this anymore. I can't take this anymore. This is too much. This is too much. This is too much. Yeah, see, the trumpet has been blown. And I feel like the trumpet was blown because the Most High called you out of this foolishness. Most High, God, Source, He, She, whatever you believe in, was just like, no. There's been a judgment call here. Be with me, darling. Yeah, there's been a judgment call. Somebody about to be successful. I just picked that up. Somebody about to be real. Now that you dropped this heavy load, you dropped this zero and got with your a hero, which is yourself. Sorry, I'm not trying to be mean to anybody. I'm just I'm just rhyming. Anyway, um, now that somebody has dropped these people or this person, somebody about to blow up. They're about to be really <laughs> successful. Because this was the, de I'm hearing dead weight. This was the weight that was holding you back from your true potential. But I'm also getting like the most, I just felt that. Like, God was like, I couldn't let you off loose yet. Not yet. Because you still had some lessons to learn. And you had some people you came here to help as well. And your family. If these people, person, these souls that you have come across, you came here to help. So the most I couldn't let you loose just yet, but man, it's time now. You ain't got to worry no more. It's all 9.44 o'clock. You about to take off. You hear me, sugar booger? 
you are about to take off. <laughs> it's about to be on and popping. Okay. Okay. On and popping. Anything positive, let's ding the bell. Yes. On and popping. On and popping. I love it. That's going to be the bell for good things. With good things happening. Good things. Let's see how long it lasts. <laughs> Yeah, see, now you're in the flow state. Woo! See, you had to let go of those individuals or persons because they were not, they weren't doing anything. They had a lot of talk. They act like they was doing things. Hell, they could have had maybe a business in themselves or they were an entrepreneur or they were in school. But how long had they been in that position? Had they grown? Did the income increase? Were they making any money? Did they were they just all talking no ex? Well, how'd their life look? You know what I'm saying? How did their life look? So the plump, the trump is being blown on this day. It was blown. It's already been blown. Because this is your present. It's already been blown. Mm-mm. 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 Could be a Pisces you're dealing with. Could be a Gemini you're dealing with. This person could be a twin, not like a twin and lover, but an actual twin. Like have they have a twin brother, sister, or something like that. Oh yeah, no, I'm sorry. The trumpet was brown. That's the past. My bad. I gotta get I gotta get it together over here, Journey. Oh, the hummingbird. Hmm. I just we heard something's about to take flight. You're you're taking flight. What's the spiritual meaning of hummingbird? Hold on. Let me see what I pick up. Hold on there, sugar booger. Somebody could be moving to Sacramento. You just got that? All right, let's see here. <clears throat> spiritual meaning of the hummingbird? Spiritual meaning of the hummingbird. Let's see what one I'm guided to. Oh, bam, freedom. What was the word I just said? I said, you about to take flight. Yeah, thank you, sweetheart. Thank you, Mosai. Thank you, Mama, Papa, Angels, God, whoever. That was me, girl. Sorry for the noise. Somebody mad. <laughs> Somebody mad. Because you're about to take flight. And somebody sees you as loving and healing. And you're going to find love and healing. And somebody knows it. And they are ripped. These people are ripped. Because you're about to get a whole new family. <laughs> if you're single, you're about to get a family and a lover. And you are not. They never thought you had. I mean, the audacity. The audacity to leave this family. Who the hell do you think you are? If they're a lover, for some of you, it's both. How dare you leave me? You, How you gonna leave me? I made you. What? The, 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 bitch, this is not Ike and Tina. This ain't Ike and Tina. What, what is going on here? You don't own nobody. You ain't made nobody. Honey, I made you. I helped you. I helped you discover who you are. If it wasn't for me walking away from your crazy self, you wouldn't even, you know, they'd still be crazy. 55 o'clock. Wouldn't be humbling themselves at all. But somebody with somebody's karma up in here today. Yeah, they were. <laughs> yeah, they were. Yeah, they were. You just can't work on any. Listen, you cannot just treat anybody the way you want to treat them. I just realized this window's open. Yeah, this open. Baby, you are, whoever this is, they free themselves. They're like, I don't give a damn. I don't, listen. I don't, li somebody like, no, I'm done. I'm done. Go on with yourself, Seer. Baby, you are free. I don't know if you know it or not. Or if you, you know, maybe there's still like a little bit of energy lingering around. You're just waiting for that last movement or step. But I see that you are taking Darling, you have taken the steps 
to free yourself. You like ain't nobody got to free me because I'm gonna free my damn self. <laughs> I ain't got time. I ain't got time for this foolishness. Yeah, reframe. Child, you are reframing your future. You're creating your damn your own path. Okay. <laughs> your own damn path. I don't give a I love whoever you are, I love you. I love you see here because you just like I'm creating my own freaking path. You know what? I'm tired. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of hearing about these damn readings. I'm tired of people. I'm tired of hearing these people with my energy. I'm tired of this. I'm tired. I'm not accepting that. And you know what? It 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 does sadden me because sometimes I am every now and then I like to listen to readers, check out what see they're talking, see what they're talking about, especially new readers, because they're still new and they haven't got caught up in the YouTube rabbit hole. Not that YouTube is bad. You just got to know how to handle it, right? But I heard a reader who was just saying that somebody is going to chase you down forever. And I said, what? And they're going to always be able to pull you back and pull you back in their energy. Sweethearts, don't believe that. Please don't believe that. You do have free will in this world. You do have choice. Just because people can... Because there are some people, those of you who are new, just bear with me, okay? You do have people that like to do energy manipulation and play. And they can alter things a little bit. Only, only if you are at a low vibration and you stay there and you give in and you say, okay, you know what? They won. They're going to forever call me in and I'm never going to be able to move on. And I'll just always, my life is going to be hell. And they'll always be my energy and they'll always be harassing me and... I'll never ever find love. I'll never find a new family. I'll never find a new life. My life is just stuck. Don't you believe that BS? Child, don't you fall for that. Don't you let the devil trick you like that. And I know sometimes it can look that way. But as long as you keep pushing and you keep striving and you keep changing, something is going to change. Okay? If you can't get around that bridge, Hell, go under it. Chisel your way through it. I don't know. Go in. I don't know. But you do not settle for no foolishness. That people that are on a low vibration are doing to you. That's not okay. That's not okay, sweetheart. And that's bullshit. Nobody's going to know. And maybe they get to play around with you for a little while. For you to learn lessons, but you sure as hell do not got to stay, okay? You do not have to stay. If you agree with me, put an ashe in the comments below. And if you know what ashe mean, is just put 100. Put a 100. Because you ain't got to accept that bullshit. All right? Okay, so let's keep going. I just got real mad about that. <laughs> I just got real mad. I don't know. Guess, guess the guys get angels. Angels, the guys get mad too. So bear with me. Let me just get the right one. I'm trying to pick what I want here. Pick what I don't want. Key. Yes, yeah, sweetheart. You are the key. You are the key. You are the key. Nobody has any power over anyone. Nobody. Now, if the Most High gives you a choice, what makes you think somebody else can, can take your choices away? Bullshit. But you believe that. You believe they lies. It's all energy manipulation. They just playing with your brain and trying to play with your mind. Don't fall for that foolishness. Especially right now, the energies we're in right now, depending on when you catch it, doesn't matter. Because energy fluctuates and the Most High knows exactly where you are. Your angels, guys, they know where you're at. These are some crazy energies you're in right now. And it's just mind tricks. I just heard, take your mind out the gutter. I know that's right. Who is that? I agree. Take your mind out the gutter because that's the gutter. That's where they dwell. And you ain't no gutter. You ain't no, what you what they call it? What the folks, folks used to say? I don't know, but you ain't no trash. Okay? You don't live in a gutter. You ain't no gutter. Get out the gutter. Ain't no trash up in here. Not on my chair. No, baby. 33 on the clock. Don't do that over here. Don't do that over here. We don't do that over here. Calm. Yeah, baby, I need you to stay calm. Stay calm. Immerse yourself in the most high and release that bullshit. 
If you gotta cry, cry. But one thing I can tell you, Journey gonna say, don't you dare stay there. Okay, I know I'm not your mama. <laughs> I'm act like I'm your mama today, depending on your age or your big sister, your grandmama, whatever. But don't you dare, don't you dare, sweetheart, stay in that bullshit. Okay, stay calm, release, cry, do whatever you gotta do, let it out. But then you get back on track. You get back on track because you got it in you. And receive. You're going to receive what's yours. You're going to receive what's yours. Whatever that is for you. I don't know. It could be, uh, you could be trying to receive a healing. You could be trying to receive a lover. You could be trying to receive a better job. You could be trying to receive a better life. You could be trying to receive to get out of wherever you're at. You're trying to go somewhere. 44 in the clock. But the most high has heard your request. This egg going to pop open. You see it? Divine timing. Your requests have been heard. I need to tell you that. Your, this is your soul's calling. This is your soul's calling. I know you may feel like there's a barrier there. But even with this barrier, look it. It's butterflies. I feel like the, butter, the barrier is you can't see. That's why. You don't have the full on answers. You're like, I need the answers right now, but right now I don't see anything. So I guess I'm stuck. No, you're not. No, you're not. Again, you defeated someone. You, de you defeated them. You're not stuck. I need to tell this to somebody. You're not stuck. Why are they not stuck? Let's take a look here. You're not stuck, sweetheart. No, you're not. Nobody's stuck. Not on Journey's watch. Not on Chief Empress Healing Flowers watch. No way. Okay? If I gotta help push you through it, <laughs> you ain't stuck, damn it. Now, don't get me mad up here. Baby, I know you're not stuck because this person over here worried. They're like, you're, 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 you're about to be happy. You're getting a new connection. You're getting new friends. You're getting new family. And I don't care. I'm going to make it seem like I'm going to stay in your life forever. And I'm going to cause you strife all of my days. <laughs> but baby, what's the say? Failure. Strife with who? Because I'm not there. Guess what? If you give no energy to this, who are you giving it to? Because it ain't me. And if you're concerned that they're throwing energy your way, guess what? If you're cleansing it out and you're not receiving it and your mind is not on that, your mind is on new things, your mind is on trying new things, traveling, doing whatever what you would, whatever. Try something new all the time. Yo, there's this, I gotta find her. I think she's on YouTube. This woman, when I tell you this, have to try something new every single day. I'm not kidding you. Some new crap. I'm like, what can this look can do? I like this cute little white girl is just doing everything. I got to find her because I like be looking at stuff. And you know what? She doesn't try to master it. Some of us, she's really good. She doesn't try to master it, but she tries it. What happens if you try something new every day or try something every week or every month and forget about this foolishness? How about that? Three, three, three on the clock. You won't even have time to think about this foolishness. And guess where that energy is going? Nowhere. Back to them, because it ain't going to you, because you don't even know what the hell's going on, because you cut yourself off completely. Somebody might need to cut off completely, like I am done done, like I don't even know you, you're dead to me, that type of energy. Sometimes you got to do it, shit, journey had to do it too, man. whatever, you ain't going to take me to the grave with that foolishness, you're just not going to do it. I forgot what I was shuffling for, anybody remember? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What's coming up? What's coming up? Okay. I didn't forget. All right. See, the most I say is strategy. You need a step-by-step -step plan of attack to reach the next level. I like that word attack because I'm telling you, if you're worried about this person, people, whatever this is coming after you, you just need a strategy. And your strategy is easy. Your strategy is, you know, I see a girl out there walk, walking. She working out. I haven't seen her walking for the last, mm, last month or two. Maybe you need to just start taking a walk. 
exercising, changing your diet. Focus on you. Focus on you. Focus on your inner and your outer. Do something different besides this foolishness. Thinking about this. this mm. Ooh, don't you say it, girl. No, I said I'm going to hit the bowl for good stuff. All right. Don't you say it. <laughs> don't you say it. Um, okay, so... <clears throat> You need a strategy. Get the advice of someone who's already where you want to go. Find people who are doing things that you want to do. Not the people around you that really ain't doing nothing, right? Watch people, learn things. Think of somewhere you want to go or try or someplace you want to. I just heard eat. Are you a foodie? Girl, child, boy, me too. <laughs> Find a new place, right? Try out a new restaurants. Maybe you can vlog about all the new foods. Do you like foods? And vlog about it. You know, vlog about, I don't know, birds. Birds, if you like birds. Vlog about trees. You know, do something. Do something different. Because this this energy ain't going nowhere. And they want you to not go anywhere. Ah. So I wanted to find out something else, but the most I wanted to get that message to you. Try something different, sweetheart. Get out there. Get in the flow state. Do something different. You want different? You want out this energy? Do something different. Do something different. Something has to change. Something has to change. Something has to be let go, even. I'm here. Something may have to be let go. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I guess the most high is going to be clear about where this, this, this message is flowing. Okay, again. Most high, God, source, he, she, whatever you believe in, is saying. You discover your genius by breaking away, right, from the grind. Follow your own inspiration, your own ideas. Bring recognition. There's some, see, and I felt that there's somebody in here who's watching you. Yes, you. That you have something to offer the world, the universe, a lot of people. Especially if you're watching me. You're not just a regular smuggler. You wouldn't even held out this long. So there's something that you need to be bringing. And if you're not sure, ask the universe to show you. And if you're not sure about that, try different things. See, it says your purpose is unfolding slowly, step by step as you go along. There's no need to hurry or worry. You are being divinely, what? What? Divinely, hold on, divinely guided. Mm -hmm. Divinely guided. Just being um, honest. And look at, nobody can touch you. You're the flower behind them spikes. You're protected. I don't give a hoot what they tell you. Don't you fall for the okie doke. Because the trumpet already sounded and you made up your mind. So don't fall back. How they say in church, don't slide. Don't be a backslider. Don't backslide, baby. Don't go back. Seriously, don't go back. Because you're protected. You're protected for the long term. And this is an opportunity that the most high, whatever. Listen, somebody is, either you need to switch something up. You need to switch positions or job. You could be afraid because this is all you know. Or you want to bring something new to what you're doing. But you're afraid because if you do, you might lose subscribers. Or you might lose, you know, your job or opportunity or customers or whatever. But there's a need to change because this energy keeps coming up. Because there's something that you need to change. And you're afraid to do it. I get it. Baby. You look at, listen. I get it. I so get it. But something is coming for the long term. There's a new route, a new career moving, coming. Ooh, yeah, fast. So I feel like it's going to happen suddenly. But this is going to give you the independence that you're looking for. If it's in work, if it's independence, if it's from independence, if it's from this energy, somebody keeps pulling on your energy, they keep harassing you. But baby, as soon as you come away from that, you make that change and you're like, eh, I am done. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done and I don't care what nobody says. I'm done. End of story. Maybe you need to switch up readers. 
Maybe you need to switch up what you're listening to. Maybe you need to switch from me. I'm okay with it. I want you to grow. I don't give a hoot or toot about your, your views. Yeah, the views are nice, great, but this is about growth. And I'm responsible. If I'm not helping you grow and I'm just loopity loopity loopity, guess who's responsible for that? Yeah, you got it. Me. Hey. And I ain't going down with you. I ain't going down like that. Not me. Oh, no. Not I'm not taking on that kind of karma. Nope. Nope. Not I. <laughs> I'm going to do it. Ain't going to do it. Ain't going to do it. Ain't. Okay, calm down. I digress. But anyway, sweetheart, you're absolutely fine. So, my message to you, let's see. Let's see what the most has advice for you, okay? I already gave you a bunch of stuff already, so I don't want to bore you. <coughs> and I don't want to keep repeating myself to, again, bore you. And I'm coughing, and that tells me that you might need to put a prayer out, sweetheart. What you scared of? That it might be answered? Because I got somebody that's, gonna, that's, that's afraid it's going to be answered. And it's not the answer they want. But somebody needs to talk. Somebody needs to talk to the most high. Or, or God or source or whoever you talk to. Don't matter to me, baby. I ain't judging you. But you definitely need to talk. You need to get that out. How you feeling about this situation, okay? So what's they doing? So the angels right now, they said, Archangel Michael's helping you and guiding you towards your life purpose. Did I not say it? Boom, bam, bam. They're helping you get there. I literally, this is all lining up. It's taking time. It's slow. Stay out your head. Stay away from this. Archangel Chanuel is helping you to forgive the karmic relation of the past. Helping you get rid of this. Helping you get rid of this. Helping you get rid of these folks. And call in your soulmate. And for that, that's also friends calling in. Some of you are looking for new friends, a new family, your tribe. It's people that understand you, people you can vibe with. Because you because you can't you can't talk to the old pe people or person. All right, sweetheart. So you are protected. You got angels over here helping you. The trumpet has sounded. You did your part. You're doing your part, and now we got to just keep, keep calm, release, cry if we need to, scream if we need to. Try some new things. Look, search, explore, enjoy life. There's so much, you know, we are taught so much to just be unhappy instead of being grateful. It's crazy how much time we spend being negative or hearing something negative 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 what about the great stuff the good stuff and then if i ain't gonna talk about that anyway that's that thank you so much i hope you found this helpful if you want to find me again hit the link the what is that button that like button if you want to find me again also hit the subscribe button if you want to know more about me that information is in the description box below of all the other places that you can find me other than that thank you so much Peace, health, and harmony. Namaste, and you're okay.